Good day everyone and welcome to spy 2 disk channel. It's time for us to get the latest of what is happening in this transfer window period. So Gustin Serino is one of the free agents. He's from uh, the former player of Mamelodi Sundowns. He has not found any club as yet. But rumors have it that his agents are having talks with the Orlando Pirates and the Key Chiefs. So we are looking forward of how are they going to conclude whether he'll be going to either of these two club mentions. So let us get to the full story of what is happening with Serino. Free agent Gustin Serino, who was released by Mamelodi Sundowns last month, has been offered to both Casey Chiefs and Orlando Pirates ahead of the 2024-25 season. After more than six years at Glock Cup and winning six league titles with the club, Serino finally parted ways a company with the Tony Giants, having struggled for game time in the later stages of his stint there. Now former coach Rulani Mukwena had also made it clear during an exclusive interview to say that Serino was unsettled at Sundowns and the report understands that the Uruguayan has also attracted interest in South America, particularly Bolivia and Chile, but the middle world has no intention at the moment to move back to his native content. It was no secret that Ateca scored 41 goals along with 44 assists in over 200 games for Downs had wanted to reunite with Pito Musamane at the time the coach was in charge of Egyptian giant al but Musumani is currently without a club, having left Abba in Saudi Arabia following the club's relegation to the second division last season. The public broadcaster being informed that although the player is wanted in South America, he prefers to stay in the Premier Soccer League, having recently managed to officially obtain a South African passport. It was late last year the pictures of Serino at the home affair surfaced on social media, allowing the Brazilian to register him as a local, meaning that any PSL club that signed the three-year-old will not have to sacrifice a foreign sport. Local teams are only allowed to have a maximum of five or nine SA players on their books at any given time during the season, hence they are always selective in which players they recruit. But Serino not doesn't have such issues which makes him a viable option although his age is unlikely to end him a long-term contract as things then both chiefs and pirates have not indicated whether they are declining the offer to snap up the free agent however Sinero's priority remains finding a club in the dstv premiership this season